your girl be Evelyn Chanel back at it with another video so this video is going to be like a catching up video um I know it's been a minute since I've um uploaded a video I'm sorry um last week I actually ended up going home and then I went to go see my sister who lives in Ridgeland um I went home for a baby shower and then I went to Ridgeland for my uh, stepsister graduation and I was pretty much gone the whole week and so the week before that I was kind of trying to prepare myself to be gone for a whole week so I really didn't edit or upload any videos and I wanted to edit some videos just so I could upload them but I'm still trying to discipline myself to do better so that's my bad I'm sorry um and I'll try my best not to um you know be inconsistent speaking of which um i'm kind of ready for all the videos that have already been pre-recorded basically to um be out and what i mean by that is so if you're watching this then you probably already know that um there's a um another series on my channel is called the aftermath which is pretty much the aftermath of the healing process and a lot of those videos were recorded in January, January, early part of February, and it is June now, and I just want to go ahead and get those videos out because it's been way too many months, I feel, um, going on almost six months now, um, this month will make six months that I record those videos, and so I just want to go ahead and release those, you know, so that we can go on to something else. If that makes sense. So, in order to do that, I can edit all those videos and probably post, not necessarily, I don't think I'm going to necessarily post them um, all on the same day because I feel like that's kind of overwhelming. So, I'll probably, like I said, post them two videos a day. Um, today is also Blackout Tuesday. But what I'm going to do today is, since it's Blackout Tuesday, you know, it's pretty much a protest and I really won't be on social media today. So instead, I'll be trying to edit videos and just really, I'm going to use this time for me to just take a break because there's been a lot going on. But that's a different um, topic for the next video that I'm about to do. You're going to see me in the same outfit, in the same place, just another video and I'll talk about that there. This video, I just want to do a quick update about me, myself, personally. So, I'm going to use today to edit as many videos as I can, specifically all the videos that I recorded in January. Um, a lot of them have already, um, I've already started editing on them. I just need to finish, you know, put some more interesting stuff in it so it's not just me talking. You know, I don't want it to be boring. And I want you guys to understand that, um... When I started, I'm still new. Have, I've been doing this for six months. So, um, the video, a lot of the videos, um, you can still, like, I'm still learning techniques. I'm still learning how to do certain stuff. So, um, I'm thinking about going back and editing other videos and maybe upload, re-uploading them. I haven't really decided yet because I learn new stuff every time. It feels like every time I edit a video, I learn something new. Or I learn how to add some, I learn how to um, use another app to put some kind of effect in my videos. So, I'm still contemplating on that. But at the same time, um, I don't know. I'm not sure. Another thing is that like, I have already started recording. I moved here in April. So, I've been here for almost almost three months i have recorded videos of course from january to march where i was in the old house and then i have ones from april until now that are in this house um and i'm i'm going to upload this um video uh first if i'm not mistaken i think this is going to be the very next video i upload which is more recent compared to the older videos and if it's an older video i try my best to um put older dates like the well not older dates but the dates that the video were recorded on them so that you guys understand the difference just wanted to explain this to you guys um i do have a um vlog about me moving in it's very it's not really long um it's not really detailed and i still haven't done an actual um apartment tour for you guys i'm thinking about doing it but at the same time i don't know right now um like I said, I do have new content that needs to be edited that I have recorded here. Um, I have a um, um a self-care day video that I've done. And 
I'm not sure if I have done my wash day yet. But you know, some just basic stuff. Um, but like I said, I do have ideas for you guys. I do have stuff in the mix. And I'm just um, trying to get all my ducks in a row. I believe that once I finally get ready to, uh, not get ready to, but once I finally upload the older videos, then everything else will be more, um, it'll be easier. It'll be um, kind of like a clean slate. I won't, you know, I won't feel like I'm jumbled up, if that makes sense. Um, so, yeah, so just be on the lookout for that content. I'm trying to make sure there's nothing else that I need to tell you guys. And I hope I'm not talking too fast. But I feel like I'm stumbling over my words a little bit. So, <laughs> I really think that's about it for the Catch Up With Me video. Um, I haven't done anything really new. I don't believe um, nothing, nothing really new has happened. Um... It's just that life doesn't stop and excuse my little TV in the background. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just that, you know, life doesn't stop and um if I'm already behind when something happens then it's gonna do nothing but put me further behind and so I'm trying to get myself together while I have time to catch up because even um the next two weekends are gonna be busy for me. So if I just go ahead and get stuff done during the week I feel like I'll be okay. So, yeah. Uh, one more thing, just a uh, um, word of encouragement for you guys. And I feel like this needs to be said because a certain situation happened to me and then it turned around and kind of happened to my friend as well. And so I just feel like this needs to be said because maybe y'all may be going through the same thing. So, um, when something happens to you or when somebody says something to you to get a reaction, um, cause most of the time that's what it is. They can be being ugly. They can try to attack you. They can try to, um, those slick shot it, slick shots that you, most of the time these people are trying to get a reaction. So, um, it sucks. It does. It makes you mad. It makes you want to get down and dirty with them, but you can't. You have to learn to be the bigger person. Don't let that get to you. Don't, don't let it get to you. Learn to be the bigger person. Learn to, um, let these folks talk. As long as they ain't doing, you know, physical harm, let them talk. They can even try to um, mess up your character, which a lot of people do, especially when they're haters. They can even try to mess up your character. But people that know you, they're going to know better. And not only that, when your character speaks for itself, your character speaks for itself. So people can say whatever they want to say, but if they're the only ones talking and you ain't saying nothing in the situation, then... Who looks like the person you know that has the issue if you are going about not saying that you necessarily can't take up for yourself but say what you got to say and be done don't go back and forth with people don't continue to um let them get in your head don't even watch their posts to see if they still talking about you because that if they if they can do that to you then they have power over you so don't let don't give them their power. And I know, like I said, it's easier said than done. But you have to remind yourself of that when you go through it. When you want to fight back, when you want to snap back, clap back, get on the, you know, on social media and go back and forth. Don't even do that because I can guarantee you, if this person is over here running their mouth and doing all this and doing all that and just talking and talking and talking and you ain't saying nothing, who looks like the crazy person? Who looks like the real person with the issue? They can try to flip the narrative all they want to. You know, say, well, she do this, or he do that, or they doing this, or they did this, 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 that, and the other. But if it's them always saying they, you, or if, if they always saying you, 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 and you ain't saying nothing, then your character is speaking for itself. Then your character is showing who's the real person that has the issue. And like I said, I had to tell myself that I had to sit, had, sit down and talk to my best friend about that because people that do that. People love drama. People like to be drama kings and queens. People like to try to antagonize you. People from your past will come back and they'll try to um, tear you down because they feel like they still have that power of you, but don't give them that. If we grow, we grow, so let's grow, y'all. You know what I'm saying? You got to be better. We got to be better. We got to have a better mindset. We got to have a better um, way of thinking. You got to. Because if you don't, you'll let everything tear you up. And the same way I'm talking, y'all, I'm talking myself. Like I said... I had to tell myself this last week because, like I said, people will come and try to get you to get out your character. They will. 
But what you gotta do is, if you need to say your little piece, say your little piece and be done. Say your little piece, your little piece, and be done. Small as small as you can, and be done. And after that, let your character speak for itself. Now, if it gets physical, or people starting to start to threaten you, then that's different. And people will try to threaten you and know they ain't gonna do nothing as well. So you have to know the difference between people threatening you and it's a real threat, and people just talking out the side of their neck. Until then, you good. You good. Remember that. Remind yourself that I'm I'm good. I'm straight. Let these folks talk. Let these folks run their mouth to that blue in the face. You be good. You be the bigger person. Even though you don't want to be the bigger person, be the bigger person. Be the bigger person. Because when you the bigger person, you realize you have more to lose. And these a lot of these people, like I said, half the time, they either just talking, just running their mouth, or they ain't got nothing to lose. And if that's the case, then you don't need to be associated with these people anyway. Like I said, and if these people trying to, t trying to talk on your name, then I guarantee you nine times out of ten, it's people around that see their character and know how they are. So you ain't even got to explain yourself most of the time. Now, there are certain situations where you do have to come in defense for yourself, but you know when you have to come in defense for yourself and when you just upset because they talking it and you want to say something back. You know you. You know the type of person that you are. You know the severity of situations. And if you don't, y'all, we can have we I I make a whole video. Um and we can we can break it down. Y'all can ask me questions and I'll 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 break it down for y'all. But nine times out of ten, you know um when you just want to say something back because you see them talking on you, or when it comes to a situation where you really need to defend yourself. But you have to have a mature mindset. And, and really, you know, want to be better, if that makes sense. And I'm trying, I'm trying, I hope that makes sense. I hope I'm making sense. I really do. I hope I'm making sense. But if I'm not, then I'll go back when I'm editing this video and make sure it makes sense, y'all. But just be the bigger person. I know I just jumped from me doing an update to me saying that, but I had to say that. I feel like when something like that happens, when it happens more than one time, um, that you need to take heed to a situation like that. When it happens more than one time, you need to pay attention to a situation like that because it very well may be God trying to get you to um, pay attention to something. And so this is my way of taking heed to um, the situation and actually sharing that with y'all, not only with y'all, but reminding myself of that as well. So I hope that little tidbit helps you. I ain't going to keep ranting because ain't no reason to rant. Like I said, I'm going to let my character speak for itself and we're just going to let it be. It's okay. So let your character speak for itself, baby. You good, love. You're good. These folks just talking. And you know it. And if you know they just talking, then don't sit out here and talk with them. Don't do that. Let them talk by themselves. Let them hype themselves up. Let the people that they got around them that's foolish to let them hype them up. But don't you worry about it. Let your character speak for itself. You be the bigger person. You hold your head up high. And you do what you got to do. So with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned. Stay tuned for more content like this. Like, sh like share, subscribe. I'm going to leave my comments open for this video. Comment if y'all want to see a video of me breaking down situations where you are supposed to respond or where you're not supposed to respond. Let me know and I'll do that video. If you have any other ideas, um, let me know about those. And like I said, I'll see you guys on the next video. Like it, like it up, like that, like that button, like it, like it, give me my likes, give me my likes, okay? Little, little YouTuber, little channel over here trying to grow, trying to spread some love and some real positivity. Give me a like, give me a share, share me with somebody, comment some positivity. All positivity over here, okay? Not saying that you can't share your opinion, but we only, only positive vibes over here, okay? Only positive vibes only. That's it. That's all. Positivity. So, yeah. Y'all already know what to do? Do that.